Hello everybody, how are we all doing today? I hope you have all had a lovely day, or are about to start a lovely day, potentially. Uh, I'm just sending a bunch of my assassins out. So, if you weren't here last week, uh, we actually finished the storyline of Assassin's Creed Brotherhood on Wednesday last week. Uh, but I still have a bunch of things I want to do. We want to do the, I think the Christina, I think might be her name missions there's some little little side quests for the uh the lady that was around it's been a while since i played so i don't quite remember but we're gonna do that uh i went through i cleared out a few more of the borgia towers and got some more viewpoints uh so we unlocked a bunch of new assassins also if you haven't been around before i killed a bunch of my brotherhood uh in recent missions so <laughs> i've been building them back up which is why we only have a few level two ones and then a bunch of level one fellas. So we're sending them all out on missions. Uh, well, all the ones that are not actually contributing to people that I can call for my assistance. So I've still got my three, three bars of brothers that I can call to my side to help me out and probably accidentally kill them all again. <laughs> But other than that, they, I just sent them all out on missions, so hopefully we'll have some more level 2 guys sometime soon. Uh, but yeah, I want to do... What do I still want to do on stream? I want to do the Christina. Let's see if that's I'm saying that right. Christina missions. I have been saying it right. Fantastic. We're going to do the Christina missions. Uh, and I want to do all the glyphs and reveal the truth and stuff like that. I also went around and um, bought a bunch of things, started buying up some places, uh, things like that while I was just playing around on the weekend. Uh, but yeah, let's let's get started. Let's head to... Oh, well, that's not a good start. Thanks, game. Uh, let's head straight to one of the Christina missions. Our first Christina mission. I think it's a series of missions, if I remember correctly. But as I said, it's been a while since I played, so whether or not that's accurate, I cannot tell you. But that's what we're going to be doing today. Keep your eye out for uh, any locations we come past that have glyphs, because I want to stop at them along the way. Let's just go to this doctor on our way, you know. Just because, for, for reasons. <laughs> Ooh, that is expensive. Let's not buy that right now. I have been of the mentality that I'm just buying whatever I come across. Uh, not too concerned about the price, because as I buy things, then I start earning money more quickly. Which is nice. But that was, that was too much. That was too expensive. I did also buy some new armor. You'll see I have, if you're play, paying very close attention, which I don't expect any of you to be doing, if you happened to be paying very close attention, uh, I have got some extra little health bars, health diamonds on my health bar. Uh, and yeah, that's because I went and actually bought some armor. I know, crazy, right? Probably should have bought some weapons as well, but anyway. It's all good. We've finished the hard part, theoretically. We've done the actual end of the quest line. So hopefully this won't be too bad. I can't imagine it being particularly difficult. So let's head on over to our lovely lady friend, Christina. See what she's got going on for us. Oh, we have to demolish the city for this. Lovely. Oh. Okay, this is this is fun. Come here. Can I tackle her? Is that what I'm is that that my purpose here? Am I running after her to tackle her? I don't know if I'm even supposed to be chasing her or if this is just a loading screen. I don't know. What about that one? Ooh, 1476. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. This is back in the olden days. Just like that? Talk about what? It doesn't matter. See, little brother, 
Most men are so afraid of beautiful girls that anyone who actually talks to them has an advantage. Just make it up as you go. <laughs> oh, it's here before he was uh, extremely Why? confident and cocky. Why are you just standing there? Oh, uh, um, because I wanted to ask you something, which is, what's your name? Not one you'll ever meet to make you proud. <laughs> I wasn't ready. I was planning on being really charming. Well, you did chance. not do a good job. <laughs> oh well. Ezio, all is not lost. You made her smile. She will remember. He did, he did recover a little bit in the end there. It was cute. I'll follow her away. That's so it. creepy, don't do that. <laughs> a second chance, follow Christina to seek the renewal of her attentions. Don't, don't stalk people. PSA. It's also like she's she can't see me. If she sees me, I'm going to lose. That is how dodgy this is. I have to secretly tail her. You know you're doing something wrong when uh, you don't want the person you're following to see you. What are you talking about a countdown? I can see her, she's right there. Alright, now I'm losing her a little bit. Alright, we're climbing up. Ooh. That was that was bad timing. Wait, get back here. Shh. You didn't see anything. Alright, we should be pretty safe now. Until she walks somewhere we can't climb above. Uh, I don't want to accidentally drop down here and miss the other side. Oh, she's looking at me. Could it be? No, it's not possible. Just in my imagination. Yeah, that's right. Nobody's stalking you. Who would possibly stalk you? That's crazy. Ooh. Okay, let's climb up and over if I can, please. Please, game. Ooh, we are right on the edge of our memories here. We are in uh, Florence right now, I believe it said. Firenze. Uh, so yeah, it makes sense that we won't be able to travel very far because they won't have wanted to build an entire map. Although we're basically probably just using the map from AC2. <laughs> I don't think it'll change much. I told you I'm not interested. See. Quick, but assassinate I him. Get in line. Kill him I now. Change history. I've decided I'm tired of waiting for you to open your legs on your own. Jack. <laughs> See? Good thing I stalked you. This has nothing to do with you. Nice to see you too. So dodgy. I think you're disturbing this young lady. <laughs> yeah, I'm not interested. Oh gosh. Bully! Uh, it would be nice if I could actually see what I was doing. That's the best you can do. Shut your mouth. I'll kill you. Oh. All right, there we go. Uh, where is the button? Man. Goodbye. Very kind of you. Are you all right? I am now. Yes. Very kind of me to stalk you back to your house and beat up your boyfriend. I met. I mean, obviously she didn't. Well, wasn't interested in him, but like, he could have been anyone. To her, he had no idea.
<laughs> that smile is cute, though. Like, adorable cute. Not necessarily, uh, cute guy cute. Just adorable. Hide away my extremely terrible looking chair. <laughs> Made it very obvious in order to hide it away, but that's fine. Alright, what have we got going on? Let's uh, buy this tailor while we're here. I actually want to see, because I checked the um, tailor on my fancy little private island uh, ages ago. And he wasn't selling pouches, or he wasn't selling medicine pouches, but this guy is. I would like a large medicine pouch, please. Does that mean I now don't have to buy the medium? It does mean that. Fantastic. I don't really care about most of the rest of these things. What is this? Mm, can carry a double-handed weapon per permanently. Like, cool, but I'm probably not going to really use that anyway, so that's fine. I got my medicine pouch. That is the main thing that I wanted. Let's head on over to the doctor so I can buy 20 new uh, vials of health potion, however much it is. 10. 10 new ones. That would have been handy to have uh, when I was actually still playing the storyline. But anyway, <laughs> here we are. We achieved what we needed to achieve. Uh, Alright, let's see where we're going Next, what are some of these? Copernico? I don't even know what that is. Uh, what's this one? Restored memory. Okay, let's go do restored memory. That sounds fun. I would, in fact, like to restore my memory or relive my restored memory. If I could just stop climbing that cart, it would really help the situation. Just take that guy out. Just tackle some random dude in the street, it's totally fine. He was looking suspicious, I promise. Ooh. Don't run into guards, please. I mean, sounds like I'm blaming Ezio, it's really my fault, let's be honest. That one's on me. Cannot blame Ezio for that one. So yeah, I think I only have two more Borgia Towers left. One of them has been giving me a really hard time. Uh, so I'm probably not going to worry about trying to do that on stream. What is this to my right? Are you, uh... Ooh, a courtesan assignment. Alright, interesting. I'm going to keep heading to my restored memory because that's more interesting to me than a courtesan assignment. Ooh, ooh. I ran into some people again. Alright, I'm going to have to take the money out of my bank vault. $7,000 in there, that's not too bad. Alright, where is this restored memory? Oh yep, there it is. I see it. If I could get down off this thing. Here we go. All right, what have we restored? This does not look restored. This looks very unrestored. Am I, am I supposed to be moving? What's happening? Ezio seems to be remembering something. Something from 1506. Desmond's heart rate is increasing. I'm administering a sedative. No, the missing data may be there. The piece of Eden is useless until we have it. Let him continue. Interesting. Yes, very interesting. 1506, so that's after where we currently are? We're in like 150 something. The Da Vinci disappearance. Did something happen to Leonardo? Nobody better have done anything bad to my good friend Leo. I will not be happy. Salai, is that you? It's you. I must be getting lazy in my old age. I did not know you had returned to Roma. 
Unfortunately, I cannot stay. I'm here to charter. This must be right before I start. I know a captain. Um, revelations. Hang on, I have the name recorded somewhere. If I'm here to charter a boat, what are you working? Get me over to Constantinople. A hobby of mine. Of course, you are familiar with Pythagoras. Remind me, the brilliant scholar from Grecia who discovered many secrets. Don't remember exactly where we are in Revelations. These symbols come from him. Ever since my exploration of that strange apple, they have been stamped on my mind. I found symbols like them in the writings of the Pythagorean disciples. I am afraid the captain's name escapes me. The apple has been put to rest. How could you, Leonardo? It would do you good to focus on painting. You seem to be doing decent work on this one. <gasps> you are kind. However, it's gonna be the Mona Lisa. She is badly drawn, and that smile. Overdone. For sure. Meaningless. Mm. But forget painting. I made a breakthrough in my research several days ago. A huge discovery. Salai, can you bring them? Oh, he's not back. I intended to accompany you to the docks, but we cannot leave my workshop without my assistant. Bene, an easy task. I am afraid you underestimate Salai. <laughs> <laughs> Wait then. Maybe you underestimate yourself, me. You will likely find him at La Volpe Adormentata. The sleeping fox. I wonder if that has anything to do with Lolpe, the person we know. A roll of the dice. Find Leonardo's assistant, Sally, the Thieves Guild. It sure does. And bring him back to Leonardo's workshop. Full sync, do not drop below four health squares. Okay. Do I have all of the health squares that I had when I came into this mission? Or did I lose them all? I think that's how many I started with. That's good. That is nice. Much nicer than the last quest, which I think gave me like four health squares. But also in that quest, all I had to do was beat someone up with my fists. So can't complain too much, really, can I? Di nuovo. I told you those dice were lucky. <laughs> Fortuna wishes she were as good as me. John are they lucky or are they looted? Salai. Better, but not good enough. What yes. does that mean? Leonardo, your master requests your presence. Let him wait. No. Nice hood. Are you one of Julius's monks? You want to have a go, My kid? My church is not of God. Outside the kingdom of God is the realm of men. You worship there, Messenger? Come with me and find I'll out. I'll beat you up if I have to. It has been fun, but I must go. <laughs> Please, do not depart. The game is not finished. Sorry, but a better offer has arisen. Lead on, Messere. Oh, dear. Not quite sure why they're chasing us, but they're definitely chasing us. From the dice game follow us. Stay quiet. What? You owe them money. Say oh my then. goodness. I am done playing. So are we. Oh, what an idiot. Oh, we can call our assassins? We can call our assassins. Did that guy just fall over? I don't think I did anything to him. He just gave up and fell over. Ooh. Nice job. There is only one man in Roma who can put on a show like that. You must be Ezio Auditore. Come. I haven't even been in Rome for right I don't know how long. You do not talk much, do you? Fine. I will run ahead. You catch up. Oh really? Only because you got a head start. Why are all of these people running towards me? Sally, did you do something? Did you beat someone up? Nah, it's something I would do. <laughs> Just run past and stand, stab a random dude and make everyone run away. Ooh. I actually have a little bit of notoriety and I see there is a poster right here somewhere. Let's grab that real quick. Oh, sorry, dude. <laughs> My bad. 
promise that was not on purpose. Yes, I do know how to do an arrow storm. Thank you, game. Very helpful. I have lost a tiny bit of health as well, but that's fine. Although I do have to stay above four, I think it was. I probably should have just fast traveled. But like now it's too late. Oh, actually. I need to level up my assassins. Bunch of them have finished their missions. So hopefully we have a bunch of level two guys. Let's have a look-see. I'm just going to auto-level all of these people. Awesome. So we got three level ones and one level two. Let's send them out on some contracts real quick. Oops. You, well, that was only 98%. If I send my level two guy, you're going to be 100%. You get... 15 XP? 11 XP. You need 30 to get to the next level. Yeah, let's just send the level 2 guy on this quest. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. That one. Just want some level 1 difficulty. I found out earlier when I was... Uh, oops. Right before I started stream, if I put two people on a level 2 quest... Or the level 2 quest I was looking at, anyway. I put two people on it. They still only had like a 98% chance of getting it. And they each only got 10 XP. So I'm just sending these guys on level 1 quests all by themselves. Because usually they have a 100% chance of success on a level 1 quest. And they get the 10 XP they need to level up. So that's fine. Yeah, I'm just using whoever's at the bottom of my list, whoever is lowest level and is not affecting my ability to call assassins to help me. Ow. You broke my armor, you jerk. Where are they all? They're all on horseback. It's not... It's not making it easy for me. Sorry, horsey. I don't want to hurt you. I only want to hurt this idiot. Who keeps whacking me because I wasn't locked on. Ooh. Good job. I should just be calling my assassins to help me more often. Because uh, that'll level them up as well. Not that it particularly matters. I don't really need high level assassins at this point in the game. I've already finished the quest line, so, you know, we're just running around doing things. They just make my life easier is all. Alright, we're now on the correct side of the river, so that'll help. Canal, I guess, technically. Maybe this is Rome. I don't know if Rome is canals or rivers. Like that. Just call assassins on just random guys in the street. Put them to work, you know? Uh, let's unlock this fast travel while we're here. Oop. Oh, it's down the bottom of this. Lovely. I mean, I know the fast travels are going through the sewers anyway, but like this is this is deep in the sewer. <laughs> Comes out still in a hole. Seems a little dodgy. Oh god, not again. Give me some friends. Give me a hand, my buddies. My bros.
Then all of them. Oh, there's one more over here. Wee! Don't do that to my friends. Okay, they got him. You guys all good now? You going off to fight anyone else? Are you just leaving? That was a very complicated way to leave. <laughs> that you're both doing. You're both doing the same very complicated pathing. You guys have fun. Look, they're just a couple assassin bros out having a good time. Oh, there was a guard right there. All right. Get rid of our little tiny bit of notoriety. Excellent. Someone's been promoted. Love that. Nice dead bodies all over the ground. Excellent. We know we're doing our job when there's dead bodies on the ground where we've been. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> they should know better than to stand in the way of an assassin. Alright, how... Oh, I'm on my island. That's... That assassin tower is pretty far up there. Let's just go to the bank and then keep on going. Get our money out. A whole 7,000 florins worth. Whoops. I knocked that lady's apple out of her hand. Again, they should just see me coming and move. That's not my fault. All right, what are you doing? The strangers do not quit. There are a Cyber lot of them as well. Appeared once before. They sought an object I had in my possession. You mean the piece of Eden? Leonardo told you. He tells me everything. That seems like a bad idea to Vinci. We must warn him. Say no more. I know the best route home. I take it every morning after the taverns close. Follow me. Okay. I'm sure we're going to run into some trouble on the way, but let's go. I'm going around. Okay. Good idea. Look at him go. You're good at sneaking, buddy. Maybe I should recruit you to be an assassin. Leonardo told me that he had discovered something Ooh, important. Someone's seeing me. He's been exploring a hidden catacomb for years now. I think he came to Roma to find it. You have no idea what he is like. He works on this all the time. He never takes me out. <laughs> I have to beg him for money. He actually gives coins to you? More or less. But oh. So what you're saying is you steal from him. Fine. I will use my imagination. Also, I'm pretty sure you're as an apprentice, you're not entitled to be taken out on the town by your master. It is too early in the day for fighting. Follow me. What time is appropriate Leonardo for fighting? In the Just out of interest. He found the entrance to a temple. Something he read about in his books. I've not seen him that excited in years. Did he say anything else? That the temple contains the perfect number. Something discovered by some scholar from Grecia. 42. Uh, the answer to life, the universe, and everything? Bring me some assassins. Get them. Is that gonna kill him? I think that killed him. You want to get back quickly? Avoid their swords. Yeah, well, they did kind of just come out of nowhere at us. It's not very avoidable. Did you notice any robbed men around here? One sec, dude. Why would I spend Gotta get this poster. I can go out and have fun. Ask the master himself when we get there. 
Why are we going directly through the Borgia Tower area? The game should know that I'm not talented enough to have completed that tower yet. Come back, Ezio, you're running way too far in front. Oops, sorry. <laughs> I do like the animation when you run into people. It's pretty good. I didn't even notice. One of those missions was called Steal a Kiss. What a good thief. All right, we made it. But we have lost the Da Vinci. Maestro. The Da Vinci is M.I.A. No, he must be here. The temple he discovered, where is it? Leonardo. Talai, you want to save him, tell me where the temple is. I do not know. Katsu. Uh-oh. It's all right. I will discover what my secrets. Well, what not my secrets. Say? Da Vinci's secrets with believe. my skills. Leonardo promised to teach me, but now. Villa, paintings. He wants us to examine art. <laughs> I remember when Leonardo lived at your villa. He was researching the location of the catacombs. Several of his paintings hung in the gallery there. What do they have to do with the temple? Perhaps the pages of his research are hidden in one of the frames. The mm, are gone. Sneaky. They all burned in the attack. No, they did not. Only Leda and St. John, the Borgia, took the rest. Ooh. Six paintings. Five. <laughs> told the art merchant that portrait of a lady was by Leonardo. I needed the money for a doublet. Of course he did. Now it has gone out of fashion. Mm, yes, that's paintings. what happens with fashion. Lucrezia Borgia, in her husband's palazzo outside Ferrara. And it is time I took back what was stolen. Noise. Find the five paintings. All right, we got a hundred percent sync. Excellent. All right, I am going to take this opportunity to take a quick break, but I will be back shortly. I will uh, play a quick ad so that people, new people coming in, don't have to deal with pre-rolls. But I. You won't miss anything. I won't return until after the ad has finished. Uh, see, I'll see you soon. I'll be like five minutes.
All right, I have returned. Let us take a look at what's going on. Where are we headed next? We have another restored memory. Ooh, the restored memory and the Christina memory. Very close together up here. So, this is an assassin tower. If I go to the base of an assassin tower, can I deal with my assassins or do I have to climb up it? Because I'd prefer to make it nice and easy for myself and just walk up to a door to uh, upgrade my assassins and send them all out on their new quests. Let's just see what the situation is here. Well, I'm in the wrong place for starters, so that did not help. Do a little lap around the block here. Uh, this one here? Yeah, this is it. Interact. Excellent. Alright. Assassins, who can we level up? Excellent. Everybody is now level 2. That's a good start. Let's send some people off on some more missions. If I send them out on level 2 missions, or even like 2 people on a level 3 mission, would that work? Ooh, 78. Let's do... Because that's still 27 experience. That's really good. Uh, so let's send three of you out on one level 3 mission. And then if I can find a level... One mission. Let's just send our last fella on just a level one mission. That's fine. Nice and easy. Make sure they don't die. That's my main thing. I can level them up slowly. I just don't want them to die. I've already killed so many of my brothers. I feel kind of bad about that. Oops, I'm running in the wrong direction. Alright, let's take a look at our map again. Let's do a Christina next. Just to mix it up. Uh, but they are in a very similar place, so I'm hoping when I finish the Christina mission, particularly the Christina one, because it takes me to Florence, I presume. So hopefully it will drop me back in the same place that I started the mission. And we'll be able to transition straight into the next restored memory. Hopefully. Ooh, I do need you, actually. I need to repair some armor. Thank you all. Very conveniently timed there. When I made my plan to go and see Christina, I also was thinking I was going to see one of those doctors, but I didn't actually need a doctor. I needed a blacksmith. Luckily, we came across one. Not that it was that big a deal, it was it was one health, square, diamond. It was totally fine. I would have survived. Mm -hmm. Hey, come back here. Tackle. The tackle button doesn't work. <laughs> or maybe I'm just not close enough. I'm pretty sure the tackle button doesn't work. Firenze, 1476. Thank you for coming. <gasps> this is after he's had the fight. After the start of the second game. Can't just leave them hanging from the gallows. You to give them last rights. He's got his scar on his lips. On the next world. Capisco. Lead the way, Ezio. Last rites. Give Federico, Giovanni, and Petruccio Auditore a proper burial. Aw, that's nice. Uh, seems kind of bad and dangerous, but very nice. Can I run? Will you will you run to keep up with me, lady? You're not completely useless. What are we going to do? <laughs> talk. Ooh, I do still only have uh, fists, though. Nice. Where are the bodies that hung here? They 
already been taken. Where? Tell me where they are. I don't know. I think they were taking them down to the river to dump them. No. Don't you Christine, dump my siblings and my dad in the river? That's rude as heck. Get out. Get out of the leaf pile, please. Let me just look at the map real quick. Oh yeah, we got a nice little nice little slice of uh, Florence here. I don't know if there's any flags or anything in this area. I presume not. Because that seems like it would be rude. Follow orders unquestioningly. That makes them. Va bene. I'll sneak behind their backs. Here's my family, one at a time if I have to. And carry them down to the river. Be careful. Oh, so instead we're just gonna dump them in the river. <laughs> I assume I'm gonna put them in a boat or something. Uh, it's so lovely how they just sprawled their bodies on the ground here. Particularly Petruccio. Petruccio? Petruccio? I don't remember how you say his name. Oh god, they're still coming around here. I assumed they were going to walk up the stairs. All right, wait for them to come past. All right, let's go. Also, are they not going to notice that bodies have start dis started disappearing? <laughs> Pretty terrible guards. If they don't come back and instantly notice that they've lost a body. All right, there's one. Going for a second one. I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but I'm doing it. Oh, this little brother's so sad. Wish they hadn't killed him. Also, his body. Ooh, oh. Whoops. <laughs> have dropped my brother's body in the river. <laughs> Let's not talk about that, shall we? <laughs> oh dear. Uh, what? I was in the process of saying something. I don't remember what it was. Oh yeah, his, his body was really not nice. His legs were all folded up underneath him. His skin is a not nice colour. Although that might have just been because he was sick. So the problem was I was trying to not dump his body directly on top of his brothers. Uh, and I ended up just not getting myself into the boat. <laughs> Alright, and that doesn't seem to count. So we're going to just have to kind of dump them on top of each other. Sorry to say. All right, let's try not to dump this one in the river. Probably a good idea. I tried to be nice and not dump you on top of each other, but the game didn't give me much of a choice, so sorry. Quickly. I like that they were not concerned that they saw absolutely anything. I feel like you see anything moving near these bodies and you go and figure out what that is. But, you know, that's just me. I have to leave the city. Christina, I want you to come with me. 
don't think this is gonna go the way you want it to, it's you. But I can. My family. So we'll always be together, Christina. Aww. I don't think this one had a 100% sync quest, did it? I hope not, because I didn't do anything special. Nice. 100%. Alright, let's go and do another Forgotten Memory. Hopefully, if it drops me back in the place I want it to drop me back in. That would be very helpful. Excellent. Alright, we gotta go find ourselves some paintings. Let's go invade a villa, I believe is what we're doing. Lucrezia's villa has our paintings. And I would like them back. Belriguado. Belriguado? 1506. Alright, this is going to be some stupid 100% sink, like, don't be seen. Infiltrate Belroguado Palazzo to find Lucrezia Borgia and discover the locations of the stolen villa paintings. Do not kill anyone. The one who got away. We might be able to do it without killing anyone. I don't know. It's you just so much easier to kill this. people, you know? Family, I raced across the ground at breakneck speed for fear of a knife in my back. <laughs> I don't understand, Duquesa. Who is trying to kill you? My father kept them at bay. Kept me safe. Now they chase after me. They want my head. Has but she gone Senora, crazy? The countryside was supposed to be serene. That follows me even here. Increase the patrols and warn me of any intruders. No one is allowed in the palazzo but my husband's private guard. She is a little bit paranoid. You heard the Duquesa. Sound the alarm if an intruder is spotted. Alright. His wife has gone there. So it seems like if they see me, they are going to have a very bad reaction. So even though our uh, bonus objective is not about being seen, we still want to try to avoid being seen. That might have actually just said something about that. I did not notice. It's possible that if I'm seen, it's just game over. That's okay. These are these ones are fun. Because there's usually a specific path that the game wants you to follow, and as long as you follow that path, you're usually pretty safe. Ooh, don't stay there. Alright, looks like we want to head directly this way. I think there was a chest over this side. That's the only reason I'm going this way. Don't think it's where I need to go. But I heard it from the other side of the wall. Look, I'm not particularly concerned about... Uh, chests and money and stuff but if it's directly in front of me I'm gonna take it be crazy not to really oops that is not what I wanted you to do Alright, so far we're doing good. Very stealthy, haven't murdered anyone. Well, I guess she's gonna have dull shoes. I'm pretty sure she's not gonna shine her own shoes, I can tell you that much. Must wait 
Ooh, this is interesting. Run! Don't like being on ground level. It's far too dangerous. Alright, these guards suck. <laughs> This is a lot of levels of defense though. How many gates did we just go past? I'm amazed about the ones that um, were standing right in front of me when I jumped down. Didn't hear anything, nothing at all, as someone landed directly behind you. Also, these guys are facing the wrong way. I don't know if that's just because I'm coming from a direction that doesn't make any sense. But it seems like they are inside the grounds. Facing inside the grounds. Which seems kind of useless. No offense, guys. Okay. They're giving me a bit of a path to follow there. Just gotta watch out for if they have any, like, wandering guards. Those two are facing that way for now, that's good. Don't think those two will see me here. That seemed rather dangerous, but anyway. We made it. Here's our window. Climb on through. We on straight into the room where she is? Oh my goodness. Buongiorno, Lucrezia. Or should I say, Duchessa. A borrowed title bestowed by my husband. Ill-fitting and barely Is a well-timed mission successful? keep your life. I am here for the art on your walls. Redecorating, are we? I count five Leonardo da Vinci paintings you have stolen, and I want them returned. <laughs> if only it were that easy. My birthplace, my family have been taken from me. You think Ferrara loves me? No. I am a stranger, a castaway, an orphan. Your paintings are gone, assassino. I do not believe you. Frightening, is it not? You have lost so much? Yeah, I lost five whole paintings. Perhaps Scary. We can comfort each other. Perhaps. Where are they paintings? Only if you give me the paintings. One to Francesco Colonna. And one to someone who was special to me. Patrizio. He spends his time near Il Vaticano. I kept one for myself. I need that. Give it to me. Guards! Hey! Place Da Vinci's annunciation in oh. the park. Okay. Leave it outside the walls. <laughs> I thought she was calling him in there to get me. Oh. Am I just gonna run away? So it is best if you hurry. Forgive me, Duquesa. Oh, I will definitely hurry. No man can heal your pain. You must Did I just so tie her up with the curtain. Say hello. Hold on. Alright, that time she's calling guards to fight me. Alright, I assume I'm still in the part where I'm not supposed to kill anyone. So we just gotta make a run for it. I think this was a bad choice. Not 100% sure where I'm going. Oop, not that way. <laughs> I think the uh, direction I have to go is mostly dictated by the lack of guards in any given direction. Perfect. Now, 
good. It's good to know that that's there, but also concerning that I may need that. Alright. Oh, is that until her husband gets home? I was wondering what the time it was for. I think it must be until the Duke returns. That's okay, I think this is the end. I think we did it with a lot of time to spare. And our cart with our painting. They were really quick to do the painting. Lucky. Lucky for me. They were very quick to do the painting. <laughs> Alright, if we can find another Christina mission next, we'll do that. Have a look at what we've got going on. What is next? So we have, this is our next restored memory. Here is Christina. Let's go and say hello to her. We'll try to stop off at a uh, assassin tower, assassin pigeon coop, something or other on our way. Because some of our assassins definitely leveled up. And I think some of them might have leveled up to level 3, which is pretty exciting. I did have a uh, either level 3 or 4 recruit at one point, uh, but I killed them. Not on purpose. That sounded bad. I got them killed. Slightly better. Still not good, but slightly better. All right. Ooh, yeah, we've got a few level three guys. Excellent. That's nice. All right. Where are we going to send you all this time? That's level one. Level five. Four, I think, is still too high, actually. Let's take a look at the four. If I send four level two guys. Oh, yeah, no, that's definitely not enough. All right. So level three. Is this the same quest that we did last time? Three level two guys. They each get 24 experience. It's pretty good. Send them off. And then our last guy can just go on a level one mission. Again. I don't know if this is the same guy we just sent on a level one mission. Uh, but off you go. Get some experience. Lovely. And, uh, yeah, let's go hunt down Christina. Hunt down Christina sounds very aggressive, but that's what we're going to do. We're going to do the thing where we go into the Matrix and we're going to chase her. Attempt to tackle her some more. I don't like our chances. I don't think the tackle works in the Matrix land. We're going to give it a go. Because why not? How far is she? 140. I keep forgetting that I have a horse that I can call on in this game. Because I'm running around a city, it feels weird to get a horse. I barely even get my horse in games where I'm actually uh, out in the wilderness. I'll have to get better at that. I think I'm doing um, Red Dead Redemption 2 next as my Saturday game. And I'm pretty sure it has a thing where you can actually only call your horse with when you're within a certain distance of it. So I have to make sure I'm staying on top of that and keeping it close by. <laughs> All right, Christina. Oh, I said I was going to chase her and tackle her, but I also kind of want to see what happens if I just stand here and do nothing. 
Does the game require me to chase? Or is it just gonna load eventually? Okay, it's just a loading screen. Firenze, 1478. Ezio, what are you doing here? I only just came back to Firenze. Look at you. This must be after I've been at Montregioni for a few years, I think it was. Oh, two years, there you go. It's been two years. And I thought of nothing but you. Oh, but Ezio. Did she get married? Oh, only engaged, that's fine. My father kept asking me to choose. I would never see you again. I mean, just because you've seen me doesn't mean you can marry me. Sorry to tell you. What? In Italy, he lost money to it. He's dragged them out to the end of the new bridge. Who the hell is Manfredo? My fiance. <laughs> oh dear. Best man, save Christina's fiance Manfredo from the gamblers. Oh, uh, what a good man I am. Go to the new bridge. There's a new bridge. How exciting. Uh, I should probably leave this area that I'm in out this way. May get a little bit trapped. Excuse me, coming through. Ooh. Kill his attackers. All right, I do have my assassin blade now. That's nice. Do I have my assassins? I don't think so. I can see my uh, assassin bar. Oh, I only have my assassin blades. Okay. I was trying to switch to my sword. That was a no go. Uh, the new bridge is not really completed. Sorry to tell y'all. <laughs> do you love her? Christina! The woman you're about to marry! Yes, I do. I, I swear I do. Kill me here and I will die still loving her. You're right. never going to gamble again. Never, You will be a good husband to her. Or I will hunt you down. Kill you myself. Good threat. We'll see how it goes from here. Uh, so he has to be a good husband, but she doesn't necessarily have to be a good wife. I see how it is. He's fine. He'll make a good husband. I made sure of it. Wh what? <laughs> yeah, sorry. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> That's all you get from me. Oh dear. I get a feeling it's uh, not going to go great from that point onwards. Alright, where are we headed next? Let's take a look at our map. Because I do kind of want to know what this is. Copernico. And this is the courtesan assignment as well, which I wouldn't mind doing. Out of interest, I don't know what it is exactly. I remember one of them did have me do something. Actually, was that a continuation? Did I do one quest and it was like, hey, you have to go help these ten other girls? It's possible. Let's go see what Copernico is. And I'm just going to unlock this fast travel point first. It's mostly on our way. We're getting close to having all of the fast travels unlocked. How many is that? 14 of 18, only four tunnels left. Excellent. Just had a little roll on the ground, it's fine. 
All right, what is this? Who are you? Who is this man? He comes from Prussia. I hear he studies at the Interesting. Some may tell you to be content with Ptolemy's explanation of the heavens. His mathematical contortions of the spheres dancing around the earth. <laughs> but why are such complicated numbers required? Perhaps to disguise a myriad of contradictions. <laughs> you must question bad logic. It is why we live to ask questions. Kill him quickly. The Very smart. All the scholars silence by nightfall. Master wants all the scholars silenced. And so am I. All right, false censorship. Defend Copernico after attacking. Oh. Defend Copernico from the attacking Borgia guards. Take no damage during the ambush. Is this the ambush? I'm not sure if this is the ambush or if something else is the ambush. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no intention of killing you. Uh, that's my bad. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, you're a big scary guy. You're a big scary guy. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. <laughs> Did my assassins get him? Excellent. Problem solved. Quick, get him while he's down. Just stab him. Stop kicking him. Stab him. <laughs> Oh, don't fight your own assassin! Oh my goodness. You crazy guy. Uh, alright. Is Copernico okay? He doesn't seem like he's near any bad guys. He seems like he's just kind of on his own. It's telling me I need to remain in the area. Which is making me a little nervous. <gasps> oh no, one of my assassins died. Oh, that's sad. I hope it wasn't one of my level 3 guys. That would be particularly sad. I assume that was one of my assassins anyway. Oh my gosh, they just keep coming. Oh gosh, yep, yep. I hope this is a countdown to when they stop showing up to murder me and not a countdown to when I lose the game. <laughs> because I hadn't killed everyone. Yes, I did notice an assassin had died. It was rather unfortunate. I also nearly killed some civilians there. All right, that's fine. Oh, I was so close to It was like one of the last guys that got me. That's a shame. Oh, well. All right, let me uh, get some healing. I was going to go straight into that next quest, but I did also see there's a new recruit. Just like right at the bottom of this ramp, I believe. So let's go grab them real quick. Since I... Uh, Killed one of my recruits. <laughs> Top myself back up. That's not what I wanted you to do. Alright, nicely done. If only I'd actually assassinated someone. That's fine. Please, teach me to fight them as you do. Will do. You are more than welcome to join my cause. In fact, that's basically the only reason I rescued you. Sorry to tell you. I'm sure, like, Ezio really had deeper purpose to saving these people. Uh, but me, as a player, I am just here for my brotherhood. Alright, let's go back to Copernico, Copernicus, whatever his name is. 
and uh, see what's going on with him. Are there any other scholars that I need to save before midnight? Sounded like they were going to kill a few people. And I'm not about that. I'm not about the murdering of smart people. Who are you that defends without cause? One who believes in freedom. Ah, yes. That's why I did it. I believe in freedom. They call me Nicolo Copernico. Copernico. I have heard your name spoken at the Borsha court. But now I have proof that you truly exist. No, oh, thanks. The Vaticano welcomes you. Yet, you are under attack by its guards. You think me one of them? Truthfully, you would be right. Yesterday, I was a Templar. And today? today? The Templars wanted me to keep the findings of my experiments hidden. And that I cannot do. Templars are big on that. For you and your friends. My fellow scholars? The logic of such a purge escapes me. Find Copernico! But we will discuss reasoning later. <laughs> Follow me. For now, we run. Out of orbit to help Copernico escape from the guards intent on hunting him down. Reach safety in under 3 minutes 20 seconds. Alright, I have no idea how difficult Same. that's going to be. Uh, but let's go. Let's get out of here. Or at least attempt to. Not entirely sure the way out. Is there a is there a way down over this way? There is. Oh, there's some guards. Are they do they care about me? Yes, yes they do. Assassins! Help! Help us! I should probably do something as well, I guess. Ooh! Ow! You jerk! I cannot see where I'm looking. Alright, come along, buddy. Now I know any guards we see, uh, send some assassins after them. I like the way that assassin just popped out of the hay bale. That was good. Alright, try to avoid the guards. I don't know if it was actually the guards that were just standing there. Ooh, let me just grab this real quick. I know I'm uh, on a bit of a time crunch here, but also very important, getting rid of notoriety. Yeah, I don't know if it was the guards that we ran past that got upset at me, or if it was actually just a separate group of guards that happened to show up around the same time. You will be safe here. What of the other scholars? How do I know I can trust you? How do you know anything? Knowledge gathering is a dangerous enterprise. Easier to stay in place learning nothing than to risk in order to truly know. All right. Cool story. Enlighten me. Take these letters to the scholars. They must be informed of the threat to their safety. And who are the scholars? You want to give me some names, some locations, anything? No? Cool. I guess we'll just figure that out for ourselves. Alright, I realised we've made uh, no progress on the glyphs at this point, but anyway, that's fine. Alright, let's take a quick look. What have we got going on? Templar agents. There's so many things on this map. Templar lair, courtesan assignment. There's our next Copernico. Well, there's actually a few Copernicos around the place. Where is our next Christina, if at all? Have we finished Christina? Is she done with us? Now that we've uh, threatened her future husband. I don't see any more Christina missions. Let's uh, go and do a courtesan assignment. I don't know if I'm particularly concerned about streaming these ones. We'll go and try one and see what happens. If it's anything interesting. We can keep doing them. If they're not very interesting, I'll just do them on my own if I feel like it. 
I don't know. I looked at the what's needed for the platinum trophy for Assassin's Creed 2. I'm probably not going to get that one. I don't know if this one is just as bad. <laughs> it's just like a lot of annoying things. Like I have to hide guards' bodies in haystacks and I have to like kill specific people a specific way. Just a lot of effort. Not hard, just time consuming and repetitive. But not all of us have been able to resist their charms. Follow Giulietta. I suspect she will lead you to her benefit. And like, I think there was one where I had to knock over five guards at one time with a long weapon. So that means I need to disarm a guard that has a long weapon, be fighting five people and knock them all over at the same time. <laughs> Just sounds like a lot of effort. Old habits die hard. Follow Julieta to locate her benefactor and then kill him. Assassinate the target from a hiding spot. We'll give that a go. Put my blades back on. Oh, you're not Julieta, okay. Let's go find Julieta. I just started following the lady that was walking away from me. We also have all of the Da Vinci machines. Again, not sure if I need to be streaming those or just playing them target located all right let's go we just have to be sneaky sneaky she cannot see us i presume as with most tail missions i feel like she's stopped and turned around here oh no not yet oh there she goes Nothing to see here. Continue about your business. I do like the way the courtesans walk. <laughs> A little bit over the top exaggerated. But very entertaining. You can turn around and look up here. Oh yeah. Good prediction. Oh. You can turn around there as well. You are. <gasps> uh oh, she's coming back this way. Uh, I did not see that coming. Oh no, she's coming this way. Get in, get in! She must have got shoved out of the way by the horse or some people because it did not look like she was coming this way. Either that or she's just super sneaky. Hey, I was just up here before. Alright, let's get out of our hay bale. No, no, nothing to see here. Definitely nobody following you. What was that bit of walk? Rather than the hip swing, she did like the upper body tilt. It was nice. Very attractive. Yeah, I wasn't really liking where I was just then. Am I safe here? It's really not. It's not a good spot. I was hoping I could catch up to the crowd in front of me before she turned and looked. But I didn't quite make it. Oh, that is not what I had intended to do. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Just threw you off your horse for no reason. Right, sit in the seat. Nice and stealthy. No one notices the person in the massive assassin hood sitting on the chair because I'm sitting between two regular people so it's totally fine all right well I see where I'm supposed to kill him from now I just need to get there let's jump in this hay bale for the moment what is that lady doing she seems rather unwell 
Alright, I think this group of people will walk past here. Should be able to blend in with them, hopefully. You guys gonna turn around and go back the other way, please? Well, first of all, we're gonna run into the horse. Excellent. Disband the group. That's right, they didn't turn around to come back anyway. I could try coming around this way. I don't know if there's quite a gap here, but I can, um, at the very least, I could climb over the top. That's right. I think this should work. Shouldn't be able to see me from here. And we can shuffle our way around and uh, stab him. She's going to be very shocked when this happens. <laughs> Oops, sorry. I did not know the bastardo was a traitor. You are no longer welcome at the Rosa in Fiore. Uh-oh. You've been banned, lady. All right. That was that was not super exciting. We can probably do without those. I think we'll survive not seeing those on stream. I've done one of these. It was also not super exciting. Uh, so I'm probably not going to do them on stream. So what have we got? We've got Copernico. That's about it. Let's have a look at locations with glyphs that we haven't done. Here's one. So we can set markers in this game to the locations that have glyphs, which is very exciting. It makes my life a lot easier. Alright, we are like 500, nearly 600 distance away from this though. Probably not ideal. But anyway, we'll make our way over there. I feel like it could be on the complete opposite end of the map, basically. Let's have a look. Oh, I'm sort of in the middle of the map at the moment, so it can't be too bad. Yeah, it's quite far over this side, but that's alright. Let's go do it. I would like to reveal the truth. Mm, this doesn't seem like a good way to go. Why are there so many cliffs in Rome? Oh, there's one at the Colosseum as well that I have not been able to locate. I feel like I might need to go looking for that one off stream. And just come back and uh, do the challenge do the puzzle part because that's the part that's probably pretty entertaining for all you guys watching me trying to solve a puzzle can be good fun all right is this a uh fast travel i haven't unlocked let's do that real quick you stay there horse i'm gonna need you again in a second unlock our tunnel Real quick. Alright, let's move. Ugh, I hate that time after you've bought a building where you're just sort of standing there looking at the building and you can't move. It's really frustrating. I'm just gonna make some assassins kill those guys. Just for funsies. I'm also gonna take a little sidetrack in here because it has an assassin thingy I don't know what you call them They're like pigeon coop things and also I need to heal and top up my medicine all right how have all our assassins gone out on their contracts leveling up hopefully I don't know which one died. I hope it wasn't one of my level 3 guys, but it probably was. Ooh, that's looking nice. We got uh, a full set of level 3s up here in our in our sections that we actually use to call our friends. That's good. Now, let's send some more out on a mission. Another like level 3 would be good probably going to be the exact same quest I've sent you on a few times already, but uh, that's fine. Ooh. 
Well, that'll work well. This level one person's going on out on a big quest to begin with. That's 50 XP for all of them, so you should actually go straight up to level three. And you guys will also go to level three. I don't know what you need for level four, but probably more than that. But yeah, you guys all go out on the map that mission. That should be good. Uh, and know where my horse went. Get my horse back. Horse, I stopped at uh, one doctor and one little pigeon coop. And you ran off on me. What a very disloyal horse this is. Disloyal? Unloyal? Anti-loyal horse. I'm sure that's exactly how you're supposed to say it. I think disloyal is correct. Oh, sorry. Uh, okay, where is this? Is this inside this port area? Does appear to be. Alright, this place doesn't look like it's dangerous anymore, so that's good. Castra Pretoria. What is Castra... Pretoria exactly. What part is Castra Pretoria? Is it this entire place? This is a big place. Let's have a look. Uh, functioned as the ancient barracks. So yeah, it appears to be the entire barracks, which is super nice. Super easy for me to find. A glyph in this entire place. Let's go towards the center. Start on these like middle buildings, which are hopefully more what we're looking for. Get a nice little overview of the whole area. Gotta listen out for the sound as well. That can help sometimes. Makes a fun little tinkly treasure sound. Classic. Classic video game noise. I wish it would still show me my map when I had Eagle Vision on make my life easier. Ooh, ow. Alright, this looks like the main sort of building. So let's check around here. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. I can't actually see if it hurt, but I'm guessing it probably hurt. Ah, here it is. This is what we're looking for. I might need to come down at, on it from up above, though. Potentially. Let's see. If I get here... Can I climb up there? Oh, I think I can do it. Nice. There's also a flag around here. We'll grab that while we're here. As well. And then we'll probably try and do another... Copernico, maybe, before we finish up. Cluster 5. We've not made a lot of progress on the uh, the truth in this game. Loading. Missed a lot of glyphs so far. Scanning. 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 What am I? What am I? Lost. That's creepy. Loading. All right, a chessboard, excellent. Democratic nations were built, each led by a powerful vizier known today by a different name, who made a move to block the Templar advance. Uh, is that perhaps a knight? No. A horse? I don't know the names of any of these things. A queen? Ah, tis the queen. Loading. 
Access denied. Rude. But of course, there had to be a puzzle of some variety. From a bolt of electricity, governments fell. A bolt of electricity. Governments fell. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, there's a bolt of electricity. Correct coordinates found. Excellent. That's a good start. All right, so three is not actually that. Three is that, which makes seven uh, like a half moon type situation. Yeah, that looks good. Now five is that one, which makes three something I don't know. Okay. What have we got? What is our pattern sequence here? We've got like a half moon. We've got a horseshoe with a line sticking out of it. I have no idea what the pattern progression is here. Literally no idea. It could be that. That's not a symbol that I see on here. That's not one. That's also not one. There's, there's too many options. Ooh. Not actually supposed to be zoomed in right now. Uh, is this where it was supposed to be? Yes. Um. There's a lot of options. Okay, so I can see there's the, the half moon and then on the other side of the half moon is a circle that's half moon, half not moon. So is it sort of like... It must be the symbol that with an extra line added to it is on the opposite side. So you can see the horseshoe and the horseshoe with a line sticking out of it opposites. And the little S squiggle and the S squiggle with an extra line are opposites. So we're looking at the one that has the three lines opposite. So, I mean, four lines makes sense. Uh, all right, so now we want one to be the squiggle with the extra line. Now this is the two boxes with the X's in them, and this is what already has the extra line. Right? So we want two boxes with an X in them, but minus a line of some variety. Could it be that? Maybe. An X in a circle, maybe? Ooh, it's that, surely. Uh, okay, now two is the three lines, which makes nine the double square with the Xs. All right, let's see how we went. Submit. Nailed it. Finally figured out that pattern recognition. <laughs> Subject, South America. If we are to ensure the company's success, company agents must be able to move freely from country to country and maintain, maintain power within all of them. A global international order must be implemented. Re-Argentina. Tell the capitalists that if they help ensure the junta remain in power, we will pass all their corporate debt on to the Argentine people. That will ensure they crush any popular revolt. I want the trade unions destroyed if we are to move forward. Chile. The free market must be allowed to prevail. F's visit last year helped this long, but now all public companies need to be sold to the private sector, ideally on the cheap. The price of bread and other staples must rise. I want to ensure the people remain marred in poverty and unable to resist. Lovely. Any traces of this plan should appear to implicate the US government. The company's involvement must remain hidden. For examples of a similar opening of, of the markets, look no further than the 1953 liberation of Iran and the 1954 liberation of Guatemala. Loading. These people are terrible. All right, we've got a quarantine. Oh my gosh, what is this? Wages should be lowered to keep the middle class subservient to us. Left to the fair and free competition of the market, 
and should never be controlled by the interference of a popularly elected government. The legislature. Lovely. H-I-S-V. All right, we got to find our quarantine clusters. There's one. We're just going to go for it. There's a good chance we're not going to get them all in the first try, but that's all right. All right, where's, where's the third one? I don't know if there's three or if there's four or what. Okay, there's one there. So we've got one here. One right around here. Ooh, nearly missed it. And one... Where was it? Was it up the top? No, it was like right below. Oh. I just missed it. There, and then... I've forgotten where this one was. There we go. Wow, that was much harder than it should have been. <laughs> Alright, let us... Can I play the entire thing? Let's just play clip. I don't want to play clip. I want to play through what I have of the truth. It's not much. I know it's not much. Alright, let's take a look at the map. Oh yeah, we want to grab that flag. Don't forget the flag. Let's do that. Okay, don't try to climb the tree, please. Just climb the wall. Alright. 20 of 101 Borgia flags. We're at like one fifth of the Borgia flags. Love that. <laughs> Making some real good progress on those. Alright, let's go find ourselves a doctor real quick. Since I just jumped off a cliff, basically. It was a good choice. Very good choice. If I can find my way out of this place. It's a bit of a maze. Oops. Not exactly what I wanted you to do. Let's just climb the wall. Tried to change direction and go up the stairs, but this'll do. This is a large area. Also, if I see a, um, what should we call it, a poster to tear down, that would be lovely. Get rid of that little tiny bit of notoriety I've got. We all know how I feel about notoriety by this point. I should hope. Can't see any. Weird. I feel like there should be one around here somewhere. Alright, that's fine. Is this just a mercenary building? Yeah, I think I placed that there. Uh, but yeah, I think that's going to be it for tonight, guys. Let me switch over. But yeah, that's going to be it for tonight. Thanks everyone for hanging out. I really appreciate it. I'll be back on Wednesday playing some more of this, apparently, because we've got a bunch of Copernico missions. We've got a bunch of... Uh, what's the other one that we're doing? The Leonardo missions. What were they called? Let me let me look at it. It's like a reconstructed memory or something. Restored memory. We've got the restored memory missions. Uh, and we've got the glyphs still to do. So I don't know how much longer that's going to take up of our time. We've got a bunch of glyphs still to go. Uh, so yeah, it could be, could be another couple of streams. Could be only one more. Maybe I'll get bored of doing these side questy things anyway and just move on. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, but once we finish this one, it'll be Revelations next anyway. So yeah, stick around for that. And uh, I think I'll be starting Red Dead Redemption 2 on Saturday. So if you're interested in that, come and hang out. But yeah, that's going to be it for tonight. Thanks everyone for hanging out and I will catch you all next time. Bye.